Good morning. Um, I just wanted to do something a little bit different this morning real quick. I want to make a short little tip video. So I learned this from one of my new subscribers this week, something I didn't know. So you have to make the seal crafting station. And these make seals that activate the teleporters in the dungeons. What the teleporters do is when you <clears throat> insert the seal in the teleporter, and there's lots of different ones. The ones that I'm currently using are the copper, and I use the hammered copper seal. Um, and the saltwater mines is where I used it. Uh, I think it was floor one through maybe eight. And I just inserted them in the teleporter. And I'm going to show you what this looks like. We're going to run down here and I'm going to show you. Maybe. So, what I did was when you get into the mines. And there's that big thing in the middle of the floor. is a teleporter. You want to insert whatever seal it asks for inside of that teleporter and it will open the door automatically I'm trying to get down here it will open the door automatically so that you don't really have to hit the switch in the floor because that's what I noticed when I did it yesterday here we go saltwater mine I'm going to show you. I don't have one to use, but I'm going to show you. So this is level one. So I used it here. So this, this pedestal is unlocked, but it won't be if you haven't done it. So when you, um, you want to craft the seals if you can before you start saltwater mines. So the first seal that you're going to use on floor one is going to be just a plain copper seal. And then when you use the teleporter, what it will do is, it will open the door. Let me see if I can get around here to it. So the door is now open. Now when you go back out, when you're done, if you don't finish the mine or you can't make it all the way and you run out of seals and you got to go back and make more because you need to gather more copper or more uh, citrine or... Uh, whatever it is that you need to make that particular seal then that door will remain open for the rest of the time and you will not have to hit the floor switch again it will just remain open and I've only made it to like floor nine so I know the next one I'm gonna have to make is what they call an engraved copper seal I've also made a plain copper seal and I have made the hammer copper seal uh, to make the hammered copper seal, you need you need your copper ore. So that for this, you just need copper ore for the plain one, for the plain copper seal. For the hammered copper seal, you need copper ore and rough citrine. And then I'm going to have to make what they call the engraved copper seal. And that's going to take copper ore and rough peridot. Paradot, yeah, that's how you say it. So I just wanted to give you a real quick tip on it if you didn't already know. And I will try to keep learning about this game so I can do more tips and tricks videos. Um, just something different I'm trying. Um, so if you like this video and the tip helped, you can leave me a thumbs up. And I'll see you in the next one. Thanks a lot.